Hey guys, welcome back to the NFT Watchdog YouTube channel. I'm Frank. I'm here to uh, talk about Enero project. I think it's an NFT related to anime and uh, streetwear. It's difficult to find out what their roadmap about because I cannot see any. And uh, from what I saw so far, nothing is explained. However, we are here today because there is an issue going on with their Discord. They have been hacked, most probably through a web hook. So basically, uh, someone uh, is taking control of their Discord, can uh, delete all the channels, everything, and can also post in the announcement a link to a fake website so people uh, bah, believe it's time to mint and uh, and they go mint and it's actually uh, not the, the real owners and they get nothing, they just lose their money. So here you can see behind me the, uh, the web page, the official web page. So not much to say about it huh, because no, we don't have any much information. However, that's the fake page here yeah, and you can see uh, their wallet behind it, it's here. And so far they managed to steal about $18,000. So let's me, let me just refresh, maybe it's even more now. I opened this like uh, 20 minutes ago. Go. Time for me to research something. Hey, we are at 19,000. So you see, still people getting uh, getting scam here. Let's have a look on the letter scan. You see, five minutes ago, so people still get into it. So one thing you guys need to understand when you look at an NFT project, they give you a date. You know exactly when the drop is going to happen and stuff. So why jumping in when you suddenly see an announcement where it tells you, okay, it's open, let's go, guy. That, that's obviously something weird because you have a date. Why the date will change suddenly? That should kind of raise your awareness about the, the something wrong. And on that case, you should not mint. You should wait for the, the D-Day. Uh, so that's one thing. Unfortunately, of course, the message that came into the, the Discord was the following one. So it tells people to check out the announcement, to uh, go on the website, which is the fake website. Huh? The, the real website has nothing to do with that. It's aneroverse.com, not .io. And they tell you the public mint is live. They make you believe that 75% of the project is already sold out. So basically creating some FOMO. So, so you feel like shit, I have to go now, otherwise it's uh, it's over. They make you believe that you're going to get gas fees but free for free if you are the owner of one of those NFTs here. Yeah? So mostly anyway, most of the people that are going to mint here won't be an holder of one of those NFTs. Only few people have them at the moment. But it's also to create you some kind of uh, look, it's, it looks official. Huh? Everything looks official. They tell you that everything is locked to uh, prevent the scam. So, of course, they, they lock themselves, huh, the scammers, just to avoid people to talk about the scam going on. Huh? Otherwise, they will uh, lose some customers. And they thank you for the minting and stuff. So, that's it. So, people who are connected to the Discord, okay? Most of you guys, they know, is they find most of them, they know exactly when is the, the drop, official drop date. Or if it's not yet announce they know that it will be announced and then they will have time to prepare for it because you need time to load into your wallet the ethereum that you need or polygon whatever and then the announcement will come but anyway you see some people that will jump in straight away because all due to the fomo that is around the project usually that's inexperienced people that that get into the scam it's very unfortunate because uh, some people will have saved maybe money for a while They're spending their savings that they they took time to make so it's kind of it's, it's kind of, it's disgusting. To be honest, it's disgusting that some scammers uh, take advantage of people like this. Um, but it's unfortunate, it happens now. So if you see this video and you're still uh, into the hype of this project, don't go mint, not at the moment, because uh, they, are, they are going to, they have to create a new, uh, a new Discord. Now, what is interesting about this project, it's not the first time, huh? it's the second time that this happened, that they got their uh, Discord compromised. You can see here, the first time was on the 18th of February. They got the Discord attack and then they said, we are going to put a lot of effort ensuring that our security is of the highest caliber. But obviously the CM behind the Discord must not know very well what to do because it happens again and if it's what I think and most probably a webhook uh, attack that's uh, that's very unfortunate because you can really avoid this uh, easily on a Discord server uh, but it happened anyway and now what you're going to see once you have those kind of attack it's even more scammers jumping in because they're already uh, ready to go and maybe the same scammers are also on the twitter and trying to to scam you again so we have this suite here our discord has been compromised if we click on it and scroll a bit you're gonna see okay got scam okay and when you click on that anyone who talk about uh, them being scammed some people will jump in and make them believe uh, that they can help them 
Up, you can see here. Sorry, mate. I advise you to quickly contact this guy here for a quick recovery. And of course, this guy is a scammer that is going to try to take your uh, your wallet. Looks like legit, but it's not. Obviously, that's another scammer. Another one here. Contact me, uh, Cyberhack Web3. You see what is his uh, profile? Coaching and trading cryptocurrencies. So. Twitter is full of scammers, guys. So very be careful. Never ever give your private key, your seed key, your secret phrase, ever. The only place you can put it back, it's into your MetaMask or your uh, actual wallet. Uh, don't give it uh, to anyone. Obviously, when you mint into a fake project like this one, but you're not minting an NFT. You're just simply sending your token, your uh, Ethereum, to the scammer wallet, straight up. And there is no way to track back the guy. He will uh, put this in a mixer, probably uh, go into to Monero and take it out into a Bitcoin uh, wallet. You're never going to find them. You cannot do shit about it. Uh, the only things you can do is to be very vigilant. When you see an announcement for a specific date, it's suddenly a date comes up, but that's probably fake. But every time someone will get scammed, that's that's unfortunate. It will always, always happen. We are not going to see this uh, stop anytime soon. There is more and more people getting into NFTs every month. 30 percent people jumping in every month and uh, since they read a lot of news about getting rich uh, buying nfts uh, and doing nothing and it's so easy uh, five minutes and drop down you're rich you buy a lambo but those people are very much into the hype and uh, and the fomo so they will get easily uh, tricked and scammed unfortunately but try to raise awareness around you guys. You can follow me. You can uh, subscribe. You can uh, share my video. I post other videos about uh, interesting topics, especially about scams. My last video is actually a post that I have on Medium. I will leave you the link in description. I explain the insights of uh, NFT project, what techniques they use to create the hype and what you can. You're reading this, you're basically going to know exactly what to avoid in an NFT project or what to kind of notice that might give you an indication of a possible Right. So look at it. It's interesting. And meanwhile, you guys have a nice day. Be careful. Don't mint into an arrow anymore. Uh, this one is going to rip you off at the moment. Uh, wait them to create a new Discord. And hopefully, the CM this time is going to very be careful. I actually contacted him to give him some tips. We will see if he wants to get the tips or not. Uh, but meanwhile, be careful. And guys, stay safe. I'll see you later. Bye bye.